Hello, welcome back to another episode of Persona 3 Portable. Last time I managed to get up to the next barricade, so next time I go into Tartarus, I will be able to move on even further. So baby, how are you after your auntie passed away? Baby is working hard. You continued on your scarf or you cheered each other on. So far so good, ne? Right? When my uncle sees this, I know he'll agree with me about the great Nihon is. I, yeah, I'm, I'm still looking at French accents. I don't know why I continue to do it. Okay, do I tell him to stay focused or should I say he'll agree and cheer him on? I'll say he'll agree because that's what he wants to hear. Good me, yes, get in. What am I now, like rank eight, rank nine? Rank eight, okay, we've got two more. So I feel like rank nine will be finishing the kimono and showing his uncle and then rank 10 will be him wanting to probably date me if this is where this is going. See, the problem is like, I want to do my academics, but I also need to get my charm up. Now, I did get my charm up to level three, which is unique. And it's kind of annoying because I still need to get up to Queen B. So I'm just going to keep going to the cafe as much as possible. And hopefully my charm will increase. I don't know any other way to increase my charm. Oh, my courage has increased from timid to ordinary. And that's because I went to go and see a horror film in the arcade for some reason. <laughs> I didn't actually know this was there, I just thought I'd go to the arcade and see what it is because I haven't actually used it yet. Your room. You sent someone's presence. I swear to god, if it's that child again, I'm going to fly kick him. You've prevailed yet again. And you're in my room yet again. Do you remember what I said before? You will face two ordeals tonight on this full moon. About everything coming to an end? Oh no, that one's that one's new to me. I probably wasn't paying attention to that one. Well, I recalled something else. Okay, what is it? I'm fairly sure that the end is inevitable. Well, you're just a ray of sunshine, aren't you? Hey, if you don't mind, can I be your friend? Can I say no to this? I mean, I'm afraid to say no because I feel like he's going to smother me with a pillow if I don't. I mean, you've definitely got creepy stalker friend vibes. I'm just going to put aren't we friends already. <laughs> you're right. I didn't really need to bring it up, did I? That's right. I still don't know what your name is, but apparently we're friends. I'm only saying that because I don't want you to kill me in my sleep. I feel like you will. After all, I've been with you from the beginning. My name is Pharos. Pharos, really? What kind of <laughs> your parents must have hated you, kid. You may call me that if you wish. No, I'm gonna just call you brat. You feel a faint bond, but no, don't tell me he's a social link. <laughs> he actually is. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> is he deaf? He's gonna be the deaf arcana, is No, shut up. I'm guessing all of this, by the way. <laughs> oh mate, no, no, I swear to god I had no idea he was gonna be a social link or the deaf arcana. I had absolutely no idea. Now I can rejoin the front line. Okay, finally, we have Mitsuru. This is good for me because someone told me that I should replace Yukari for Mitsuru because Mitsuru's better. I think maybe it's best I go and talk to Theo and see if he's got anything new for me since I can now progress. Bring me a Christmas star. What? Bring me an item known as a Christmas star. It should be obtainable from someone on the 27th. Who the hell's going to have a Christmas star? I'd like to visit Iwata Dai Station. Yeah, we can do that. Come on, Theo, baby. Let's go on another date. Theo doesn't seem to want to get on the escalator. I could just imagine him being like that one scene from Elf where he's struggling to get on and then he just stretches his legs out and is just going up it slowly. I've heard of this. It's called an escalator, no? We can use the actual stairs if you want. Despite Theo's words, he isn't budging from where he stands. <laughs> it's okay to be scared, buddy. Okay, he wants to try them out, but I want him to take the stairs. But I think the best thing to do is escort him onto it. I can't allow you to do that. Okay, sorry. Just trying to help you out. I'll go on ahead. Please, allow me. Theo took your hand. Wait. You, you, you didn't want me to escort you, you're taking my hand. Okay, what are you going to get me for showing you around? With this, you can fuse Empusa. Okay, cool. Another fusion. There's a strong one on the 50th floor. Please remember that. Uh, I mean, the 50th floor is nine floors away. We'll be fine. The strong one might actually be closer than I thought. Wow, you're not very good at this, are you, Fuko? You're not, you're not. Mitsuru, do me a favor. Take our place again, yeah? Oh, look at him. Okay. Um, yeah, uh, I don't like where this is going. All right, let's... Um, how do I, what should I do? We'll bewilder it. Okay, we'll, we'll make it distressed first. I don't know what it's going to be weak to. I don't really want to risk anything at the moment. Luckily, being distressed also increases my crit chance, I believe. So, all out attack time. Oh dear, what's it doing? It's charging up. Okay, he's actually weak to lightning. I was going to use lightning first, to be honest. What? Oh yeah, I forgot to change her over, didn't I? Whoops. <laughs> She's in charge of herself at the moment. Oh, well, anyway, I start taking care of anyway. I mean, <laughs> probably would have just messed up if I used her anyway. I confirmed the big one's location. It's on the 47th floor. You lied to me, Fuka. You said it was on 50th. There are three shadows in the middle. And it's going first. Oh, that's, that's amazing, that. All right, what are you weak to? Uh, all right, well, let, let's, de let's decrease this one's attack, yeah? I mean, because the third one didn't increase its attack yet. So let's just... Uh, he's fixed himself back up. All right, let's try Mabufu. Ice 
<laughs> yeah, okay. Um, well, they block ice, so... I are? Question mark? Okay, well, it, it hits him at least. Alright, let's have a look. Four analysis, and I think the thing to probably do is to distress one of them, maybe, if it works. I mean, evil touch didn't exactly work. Okay, yeah, that's not the best thing to do. If I fail this, I know for a fact it's just going to be a practice run. And they're weak to lightning. Beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. The problem is, like, they're only taking eight damage. It's really bad. <laughs> I need to desperately get something to decrease defense. Like, absolutely need it. Maracondo, what's that? Oh, that's what I need. You're very helpful, Fuka. Thank you very much. Alright, what have we got? Deals shock damage to all foes. Here we go. Beautiful. I'm glad I kept this. She says let's finish this, but they're going to be left on, like, the tiniest sliver of health, and it's going to torment me. Yep, we don't we don't have any... Ooh, oh, but it's only one foe, and I've got two of them. Ooh. See, I'm only doing this now because if they get really lucky and they all gang up on Gurley, I'm going to have to restart the fight. Now, bearing in mind, I do know their weakness, which is fine but I'd rather get this out of the way now. And this is looking like a crit. If it is, I'm done. Get in there, Junpei. Well done. That was actually an easy fight, to be honest. I mean, I don't care that I still had to waste items for it, but, you know, <laughs> dead. I get to move on swiftly. Ooh. Oh, yeah, I see a gold one. I see a gold one. Turn around. Turn around, damn it. No, no, no. Not this way. Not this way. Not this way. Go away. Stop it. I want to kill you. Oh, this this thing, this thing knows. It knows. It's following me. It's still coming down here. Go away. I'm just going to wait for him to just turn his back on me and then I'll go and sneak up on it. There we go. Nice. I don't have the quest on. Crap. All right, here we go. Rush. That's it. Nice, nice, nice. Finish him off. Well done. Beautiful. Oh, we got the... Wait, did... Did I need that for something? Oh yeah, no, no, I, I went to the antique store. The lady said I need to have things like that from the treasure hands. So that's good for whatever I need to make, I guess. I've actually completely forgot what these things are weak to. Oh, oh, that was so scary. Oh, what are we dealing with here? Oh, this thing looks evil. All right, let's have a look. Uh, what am I looking for? Tactics, backup. What are you weak to? Let's use Tarakuja on Junpei. Just buff up his attack a little bit. All right, now let's uh, let's try a double fangs. Like this is purely why I've buffed up his attack. Okay, um, didn't really help, and neither is this. All right, are you weak to lightning by any chance? No. Oh no, you're one of those insta killers. Great. Okay, that was a light attack. My guess is you're gonna be weak to darkness or something. Oh, I froze him. <gasps> I froze him. Wait, this, is this good for me? Uh, what was it? It's shot for physical, and I think it uh, is it is it magic for. Ross, I, I can't remember. I'm going to try magic anyway. Okay, maybe, maybe it is physical, so we'll try another double fangs. No, it's not. Damn it. There's something you can do to get an all-out attack, but I, I can't think of it. What the hell is this? This is wind, isn't it? Yep, okay. Now I'm glad I decreased this attack. Mind charge. What is this? Oh, it's focused. Oh, that actually scares me a little bit. <laughs> That's actually really annoying. I made Narcissus. Purely because it's also strong against wind. And apparently I can charm this thing, according to Google. Don't know if that's going to work on me, though, because, like, you know, evil touch has not been very good for me on anything. Maybe I should have decreased its evasion first, actually, before I did anything. Yeah, this isn't going to work out, is it? Okay, yeah, let's, let's actually try what I said and decrease its evasion. Now we'll try and charm it. Maybe I should have, I don't know, done the evasion the first time round because I've got charm boost. Okay, I've charmed him. Good. Now, what do I do? Okay, I mean, I guess now that I've charmed it, I guess the thing to do is just beat him up. I'm, like, doing very little damage to this thing. I'm thinking maybe I'm severely underleveled for this. I think this is looking like another training session for my party members. I don't know how long charmed lasts either. About three turns, maybe. So I think I've got one more good turn of actually trying to batter this damn thing. I can't use wind because it apparently absorbs wind. I found that one out last time I tried to fight it, so... I guess I'm just going to have to use gems on it. That did 100 damage. That's doing more than what I'm doing. Well, I might as well use them since I'm here. Still been charmed. That's good. Okay. But I'm switching back to Narcissus after this because I don't trust what's going to happen. Okay, it's recovered. Yeah, mind charge is happening. Now, if you want to be really nice and shock him right now, we might stand a chance. No, we're dead. All right, let's use this and raise everybody's defense. Oh my god, how lucky was that? <gasps> now the thing is, it's, if it's charmed, can I still hit it without it counter-attacking? Yes, okay. I might be able to. I don't know yet. I'm too scared to even try it. 
Okay, no, he's still... Con God damn it, that's annoying. He's still been charmed, that's good. I'm pretty sure his attack should go down next turn, and I'm hoping it does, because then he won't have to do a really powerful wind attack on me. Not only that, but it's it's looking like I could win this fight. Just to be on the safe side, though, like, you know, just, just to be on the safe side, let's, let's just raise everybody's defense a little bit, just in case. Like, let's, let's just be safe here, yeah? I mean, Mitsuru and Akihiko, their defense just reverted, because they already had it in effect, so... Yeah, when it does inevitably do this, I'm probably going to lose them. I mean, I lost one of them, so that's that's not fun. Let's get Mitsuru back up with a Revival Bead. Now we use Umagi Water, because I need everybody's health back up. If this thing tries to even wind attack me again, that will be it. Okay, it's mind charging. Fantastic. Assuming Mitsuru can have a go next, I might be able to finish this off. Okay, we're good. We're good. This could be it. This might be the big finish. Okay, he's frozen though. Come on, Yukari. Get in there, well done, Yukari. I'm so happy I put you back in. Oh, look at that. Another barricade. Yes, I'll just wait for the next full moon, which will be next video. I'm not going to end the video here. I'm going to do, like, one or two more things, and then I will. Like, I want to at least try to get rank 10 for Bebe. Yes, finally, my charm's gone up to Queen B. Get in there, now I can talk to Akihiko. Why am I getting called from Theo again? I have business with you, so please come visit the Velvet Room at your earliest convenience. Please forgive me for calling you like this. There is something I must bring to your attention. There seems to be someone inside Tartarus between floors 44 and 47. It seems that someone without the potential who heard the voice of the shadows, if left alone they will become lost in your world and may die. Let them. There will sometimes be people wandering into Tartarus. If they are not rescued by the next full moon, they will be lost. Information about missing people can be seen on the bulletin board at the police station. Right. And how often do I see that? Like, honestly, how often is there going to be a missing person? All right, it's Friday. Um, I don't need to go and see Bebe, so let's go and finally start Akihiko. Seriously, the ramen bar again? What is it with these people? Two extra large specials, please. Can I order some appetizers too? Amazing, you completely polished that off. Hey, are you up for going to another restaurant? <laughs> Damn right, let's go. Don't let yourself suffer just to be friendly, seriously. Just accept the fact I want to hang out with you, goddammit. What the hell, you're, you're the star? Really? Not gonna lie, I would have thought you would have been, like, the strength of Arcana, given that you're a boxer. But I guess star works out in a weird way. Academics is above average, very nice. This will be very helpful for my next exams. Fuka has returned home early and is playing with a white dog. What? what why, are we, why, why do we need to know she's playing with a dog? Give me your paw. Okay, is the dog important? Koro-chan, go say hi. You can do that, right? Well, hello to you, Koro-chan. Oh, he nuzzled me. Oh, I love him already. His name's Korumaru. I've seen him sitting by the steps of the shrine. And you took it upon yourself to bring him home. I approve. Oh, this dog still goes on walks all by himself? What do you mean? He used to belong to the priest at the Naganaki Shrine. And the priest is dead, I'm assuming. Every afternoon, the two of them went this way for a walk. That explains it. Well, until the priest passed away. Yep. <laughs> Guessed it. He passed away? Everybody dies in a situation like this. You, you, like, why are you so surprised? Oh, by the way, this is going to be a bit weird. Um, I need glasses wipes. I know I don't wear glasses, but, you know, it's for... A, it's, it's for... I don't know how to describe him. What's my reward for the glasses? Amigo Poncho. Great, I'll be putting it on someone. I don't know whom. Probably girly. Oh, cool. Meanwhile, at Tatsumi Port Island in the back alley. Why is it always this specific area? Uh -huh. Oh, it's you. I remember you. Good evening. Oh, Jesus, who's talking to him? Are you surprised? Oh my god, what the hell are you? Truth be told, we all visit this world every night. What are you saying? Who the hell are you? Didn't mommy teach you any manners? You haven't introduced yourself. What is going on? Why is Uryu from Bleach in this all of a sudden? Take a look. Name, address, age, etc. This is you, right? <laughs> and they know everything about you. Where did you get this? Somebody's got a grudge against you, and they asked us to get revenge. Revenge? What kind of bullshit is this? I don't know, man. I mean, you kind of deserve it, to be fair. <sighs> May we get this over with now? Oh, Jesus, he's got a gun. Hey, w wait, wait. I haven't done anything. Why me? What did I do? That is not our concern. Wait, hold up a second. I'm pretty sure this guy's voice actor is actually Uryu from Bleach. Yeah, guess what? I've just Googled it, and this guy here is voiced by Derek Stephen Prince, who voices Uryu Ishida. Oh, stay away! Just accept your fate. Allow him to shoot you. Get away from me! You squeal most magnificently. 
Oh, that's actually really terrifying to hear. Such raw emotion. And he's dead. He's not dead. Oh, okay, well, thanks for ruining my fun. You're having a good time hanging out with baby. There we go. I am finished. You worked hard, I think is the right word to say here. Yes, it is. I have to say goodbye. No, 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 no. We're not saying goodbye for a little while. We're getting to rank 10 and then we're saying goodbye. Please take this. Obtained a money pouch. What, why have I got a money pouch? Wait for my return, girly summer. I hate you so much. You feel your relationship has grown stronger. This, this better be rank 10. We're done now, yes? We're done. We've maxed it out. We don't have to come here ever again. God damn it, man. Just let me flip and save it. You still haven't made up your mind? Oh, he's a Persona user, isn't he? Okay. I'm kind of hoping you join my team because I feel like you're going to be pretty good. We've got four new members. Yeah, he's a Persona user. Things have changed quite a bit since you left. We're more aggressive now. I'm not interested. Think about it, Shinji. Don't let your power go to waste. My power ain't worth shit. Oh, uh, I don't know. I reckon you might be good for the team. <laughs> I'm just saying this because I really want him on the team. I just want more party members. Shinji, I made up my mind a long time ago. I ain't going back. You have to let the past go. Why is he not coming back, though? I don't understand. Like, did something bad happen? And he's just like, yeah, no, I ain't getting involved in this ever again. Face it. You're no different than me. I mean, Akihiko's also got a secret, so I'm feeling like, I don't know, maybe they had a previous member who died and they're blaming themselves for it. I don't know. Like, that's just my assumption. Okay, well, that's where I'm going to end it. I'm going to use this opportunity to train up and get some stuff that I need for some quests, and I'm going to sort out a lot more things for next time. So if anybody did enjoy it, then consider leaving a like, subscribing, and commenting, and I'll see you again for the next one. Thank you for watching.